Couple showers around. Well, more numerous showers in the lower valley today. So if you're in Cameron or Wilson County, you saw the best rain around. We'll show you some of the rainfall totals here, but still maybe one or two little showers left over over the next couple of hours late this evening and tonight. But otherwise, spotty showers still possible on Thursday. Probably dry uh, just about everywhere tomorrow and even more so by Friday. But maybe a few showers if we're lucky tomorrow. We'll you know, check back. Just watch the skies tomorrow if you see something building up to your south or southeast and you may get a quick shower. Nothing out there tonight. There's still a chance of maybe a little shower briefly popping up, but any little showers, you see those little dots right there, a couple of them, you know, they faded away this evening, so mostly dry now. But rainfall today, roughly about, say, 30% of the valley saw some rain today, mostly in Cameron and Wilsey counties. You see the blue colors there, and that was from this morning, a couple showers in western Star County, but most other areas dry. And some of the rainfall amounts, these light blues generally indicate about a quarter to half an inch or so in some areas. The darker blues, you get up to around three quarters of an inch or so in a couple of the heavier spots. You can see in Cameron County, we had areas just south of those Fresnos, about 0 0.7, 0 0.8 or so, and even northeast of Los Fresnos at, at about those amounts. So a little downpour in spots. Temperatures tomorrow likely starting off in the upper 70s in the morning. Probably going to see some clouds in some areas initially, but I think we'll see more sun break through the clouds as the day goes on. So temperatures likely back in the 90s tomorrow. Rain chances only at about 20% and probably less rainfall than some of these showers today when they do occur. Future track shows dry weather overnight with partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow morning starts off dry, but again, by noon or so, you start to see little showers pop up in some areas and kind of move west or northwest again. So again, you might have some quick downpours tomorrow in spots with the sea breeze and maybe a few showers in the afternoon, but overall, not a lot of rain. I mean, it's possible there's still enough moisture in the air. If you get a slow moving shower, you might get one of those ones that add up to more than an inch or so, but most places getting much less than that if you do get rain. Thursday going into Friday, the atmosphere starts to dry out a bit more on Friday and stabilize. So you don't see as much rain here forecast, maybe a little tiny sea breeze shower or two, but I think mainly dry weather on Friday. Saturday is kind of a borderline day on this model. It does show some showers starting up. I think Saturday has a better chance to be pretty dry. Maybe Sunday could look a little more and better in terms of showers. So uh, kind of watch the weekend. I think maybe Sunday could be your best chance to see uh, at least some scattered showers or a couple of daytime showers. So 20% chance tomorrow, mainly dry Friday and probably mainly dry Saturday. Uh, maybe Dina's giving me the look. <laughs> uh, be dry at her house for sure. Uh, <laughs> if you want to check the radar, KRGB mobile app, you can download it for Android and iPhone. <laughs> I love picking on Dean at least about 30 times a day. So uh, your first one, five, seven day forecast. Get up, get up, <laughs> Highs around 95 tomorrow. A couple of showers here and there during the daytime. So, you know, maybe keep the rain gear handy tomorrow. Not much rain on Friday and probably Saturday, but maybe even Dino could get a shower on Sunday. Our rain, maybe, 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 just maybe. Yeah. Our rain chances may go up a little more Sunday, so we'll track that for you coming up next half hour. Well, it was a real treat to be in the 80s today. <laughs> yeah. That was I mean, nice. Best day of the month. Yes. All right.